That's correct. First, we have the solemnity of the Immaculate Conception. Viva Maria! Viva Maria! And of course, the second reason for our gathering here today is the closing of 100 years of the MIC presence here in the Philippines. Correct. And third, it's of course, the silver jubilee of the religious profession of Sister Mary B. at MIC. So among us today, we have the exemplary follower of Jesus celebrating her silver jubilee of religious profession, Sister Grace. Yes, Sister Grace, the day is all about the yes as you celebrate all that has happened over the last 25 years. This is a perfect time for looking back and looking forward. Okay, and to begin this auspicious occasion, may we all stand up for an opening prayer to be led by Miss Mary Rose and La Rosa to be followed by the singing of the National Anthem. Requesting everyone to please stand. Let us now dispose ourselves in the holy presence of God. All together, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Almighty God, with joy in our hearts, we offer you our praise and thanksgiving as we joyfully celebrate the solemnity of the Immaculate Conception, the closing of the 100 years of MIC presence in the Philippines, and the Silver Jubilee of Sister Mary Grace B. Julian, MIC. We thank you, Almighty Father, for your grace and mercy. Amidst all the challenges that we face today, the threat brought by COVID-19 pandemic, may you continue to shield us with your mighty protection, empower us to continue our mission here on earth. We thank you for your precious gift of the Holy Spirit, through which countless of your children have been called to serve you. We pray in a special way the missionary of the Immaculate Conception that they may continue to flourish in their mission of their steadfast love for evangelization of the good news of Jesus Christ. May they continue to enliven in the MIC's ritualty of thanksgiving. Above all, on this happy 25th anniversary, we thank you for the constant commitment of Sister Mary Grace B. Julian, MIC, to her selfless Christian service of the Church and of your people. For your richest blessing upon her, we pray and grant her many more years of committed service to the works of God. This we ask and pray through Jesus Christ, our Lord, with the intercession of the Blessed Virgin Mary, whose solemnity of the Feast of the Immaculate Conception we celebrate today. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
give her opening and welcome remarks. Our school directress, Sister Leticia B. Dolio, MIC. A round of applause. The words of Pope Francis also challenge us to go out 
exalted Aunt Eli with Mary of the Magnificat. May we always be faithful to the gospel, to be true to our being religious missionaries in thanksgiving to the example of Mary and to our evangelizing mission in the church. My dear friends, happy celebration. Enjoy the rest of the program prepared for you by our teaching and non-teaching personnel. Welcome and thank you for being with us this evening. Thank you for the welcome message, Sister Letty. And everyone, as we close our 100 years of MIT presence here in the Philippines, let us have an AVP presentation for us to look back and recollect on how the MIC's presence radiates positivity in the Philippines. Yes, Sir Lester? That the MIC presence is not just here in the Philippines, but all over the world, right, partner? That's correct. And yes, we have people from Thailand, Vietnam, Canada, Baguio, specifically Mati. We are all over the world, but we have four missions. That's now, correct. while waiting for our ABP, may I ask some people on our core mission as 
century is no joke, right? And so we thank the pastors who some have already gone to be with the Lord and to the MIC sisters who are present here and still carrying the torch forward. Now, as an educational institution, I think it is just fitting to have a quick quiz, right, Miss J? Let's just have a quick review on how do we live in a Marian way.
years and more lessons. That place is the place. That is the place. Such an honor to have you part of my new journey. We will continue to be an inspiration for young ones as you did to me. So God bless you abundantly. Happy Silver anniversary, Sister Chris. Happy 25th anniversary of the Philippines. to shine, to spread love, joy, and thanksgiving to everyone that you meet. And wish you many more for another 25 months. Bye, God bless. Hi, Chris. What did you have prayers today as you celebrate your 25th Jubilee? And wish you all the blessings that God has in store for you. Not only today, but all year through and the years to come. But make it that. The Lord has done great things for you, my dear Grace, when you were to celebrate your 25th year of religious profession. Congratulations, my dear.
to my guests and uh, classmates in my employees uh, mga auntie and mga cousins I I don't know what to say I'm already speechless um, I'd like to reiterate also with what I have said in the, in the during the mass for thanking each one, especially our IMA community, headed by our FSA President, Sir Milito Alfonso, uh, for making this very special. Actually, I could bring the thing of preparing this one, uh, no matter how they tried to keep it secret from me, but they had no choice to ask request from him. <laughs> so I know I complain all this and that, but anyway, Sister Daddy is there supporting. I said, okay lang na. Iba, I was not in love. Okay lang. But for me, I was already complaining. Um, maybe because it's my, I'm not used to um, to celebrate for my, I mean, to I mean, I am the focus of the celebration. I used to be at the background. I used to be even Bishop noticed that. I used to be at the back, uh, making sure that everything is okay. Everything, uh, the program goes well. But this time, I am the starring. And this is the most difficult part, to be the starring of this celebration. Uh, no matter how I try to hide or what, but I have to be here in front. And to be, uh, that's the thing. That's the, I said to myself, I even told Sister Betty, and to my community members, sisters, pagkatapos ani, mutan ang yung kukubi, kay di mo kurong makudiri. I am not, I am always the back. And, but because it's my 25 years, what, what else can I say? But thank you, Lord. I survived. I survived uh, because of His faithfulness. Bishop was saying, God's faithfulness uh, is always there. Even if at times I'm not that faithful. But the graces of God is there, are there to really help me persevere. There were moments in my life that I doubted. But there are always but the graces of overflowing. Every time I see my relatives, my aunties, when they are proud of me, I feel humble. Because I know I am not that, I would say, the only one or the... But I try my best to live my life I see life. Uh, my companions here know me. Uh, where are the maintenance? Uh, they know me how I deal with them. The canteen. My companions in their office. Uh, that when I saw you, dancing, singing, and I heard that the board was there to prepare. I asked them to be prepared on our service at 4.30 because I had, we had no time, we were all busy preparing, but we will try our best. And so, I really hope um, by, by your thoughtfulness, by your, the old, for your own efforts that you, they, you make this special, nakalag carpet pa, and all of this preparation took the time and canteen especially uh, they are behind they are the one preparing for the food uh, the, the non teaching personnel the teachers, the faculty grades for high school faculty members I heard them practicing I just um, I just just uh, ignored them but I know it was for me and when I went at the back Instead to, to check the people in the maintenance, they were practicing, they were dancing. Even those maintenance men who cannot dance, they were they forced themselves to dance. I want that is uh, I try to not to be the one in the nakita sila. So, but I know they prepared that much. So, what else can I say? But thank you so much for all the efforts to for making. My day, our day, very special. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sister Letty, for the music to celebrate with us, to, to make this celebration very meaningful and successful. Thank you so much.
so much. All right, thank you very much, Mr. Lee. And once again, congratulations, sister. Thank you, sir, MC. Thank <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's the end of our program. And this has been Vincent Pabuan. And Miss J. Filizorto leaving you with a saying that may we all continue to spread our mission and joy. And thanksgiving. <laughs> <laughs>